Hey everybody, Christine here to make a box opening video for our Fairyland Mini Fee Fairy Line Body Sia. Where's mine? Here we go. So, uh, this is a second hand item. I bought this off of someone on Instagram, uh, which is why it's not coming in a bigger box. But they still sent me the COA and the original box, which should be in here, hopefully. This has a lot of tape on it. Hopefully I can get it open. Alright, let's see if that worked. Uh-huh. You know, they make me use this blue tape for my classroom, but let me tell you, it's not very good. <laughs> uh, it never sticks anything to the walls. I don't know if you guys have had this problem. That's probably why it's called painter's tape because they use it so it doesn't rip off the tape or excuse me the paint on the walls there we go okay hopefully this doesn't show my address because it keeps falling let's just do this there we go Aha. seems like it's upside down kind of a smart idea you know cut up a box so it fits the original box perfectly most of the time I just get like a humongous box and it costs like 20 million dollars to ship that's not good all right my address is showing on this side so let me try doing this there we go all right so I guess this is what it is so here's the box and I guess the fairy line uh, box looks the same as the mini fee uh, A line box. Okay, here is the COA. Let me show you. Hold on. Bloop. So that's what it looks like. Here's the back. And let's see what she looks like. So there will be doll nudity. I guess I said that a little bit too late. Bloop, here we go. She's like really loose, like super, super loose. Now, this is, this is the fairy line body, which is a little bit different than the mini fee body because it's supposed to, yeah, it has like this little socket over here where you can unhook the top part of the body. There you go. And uh, you can put like different legs and stuff. She's very loose and I don't know how to restring dolls. I know it's kind of pathetic that I have so many dolls and I don't know how to restring them, but I don't, sorry. So I guess I'm just gonna have to work with this incredibly loose um, body. So her hands are magnetic. It came with one pair of hands and it came with the flat feet and the heel feet. And like I said, I got this from someone uh, secondhand on Instagram and I am the third owner. Uh, let's see, the face looks pretty decent. Doesn't seem to have any um, scratches or anything. She does have like a little spot on the head where they sanded the seam line. Hopefully it's showing up. Now, if you're wondering the difference between the A-line body and the fairy line body, I heard that the bust area is a little bit thinner. So sometimes the fairy line heads don't fit correctly on the A-line bodies, but don't quote me. Now, there is one difference that I noticed um, from the pictures and I looked online to make sure and this is this, the case for all the dolls inside their head cap besides having the normal mini fee neck connector there's actually an S hook so let me show there so here's what it looks like so it looks like a mini fee neck connector and I'll actually put pictures at the end so you can see a regular mini fee neck connector compared to the fairy line one 
but it has an S hook here. And the reason that they do that is because you can actually unhook this and take the bust piece off and the arms are supposed to come out too. So hmm. they're not coming out for me, but there's like a magnet in there and they're supposed to come out, but I don't see how to do it. I know you can though. So they're supposed to be really easy to take apart. I saw it in the Fairyland video. And the head still goes on the same. And then you just latch it on. Bloop. And then the inside of the head cap for Sia looks like this. Let's see. So there's no name here and there's no name here for Sia, which is weird because some of their head caps have the name of the sculpt and then some of them don't. I don't know. I know that some of the other dolls that I have, I think Hawaii doesn't have her name inside. Um, but then some of them do. So I don't know what that's about, but all right. She comes with white eyelashes and these are the um, like upgraded eyes that you get if you get the full set doll. So of course I don't have the full set doll, but she comes with those upgraded eyes. Now, any Fairyland doll has seam lines, but especially there are seam lines on their tan. This actually looks like a, a little darker than my other tan dolls. Maybe I have to do a comparison. I don't know what year she's from. The person said that they thought that she was from 2015, but I'm not 100% sure because again, I'm the third owner. So here's the body from the front. Here's the side. These are the cutie legs. And then here they are from the back. Will she stand on the phone? That'd be kind of cool even though she's kind of loose, right? I know that mini fees are very good at posing. I mean, I have a few of them and uh, they usually stand pretty well, but I can't get her to stand on this. Let me check here. You know, out of curiosity, it'd be nice to know. All right, cool. So she does stand very well. Here's what the inside of her hands look like. So very, very similar to the A-line body, except for the fact that they can be taken apart on the inside here. I don't want to take her apart now. And this part right here has a spot on the inside that you can pull the bust up and take it off. But again, I'm not going to do that because I'm not very good at restringing or redoing anything. So I'd rather not. Let's see what the inside of the legs looks like. All right. So this is definitely one of the older uh, models. The, well, actually I don't have a fairy line doll to compare, but my A-line dolls don't have this. They have a hole here. Let's put it back. There we go. All right, so I'm going to have some pictures at the end so you guys can see this body next to an A-line body. And you can also see the difference in the neck connectors because when I first got her, I actually was like, this is not what their neck connector looks like. Maybe they printed a different one. But then I was like, oh, it's fairy line. It's not an A-line. All right, so thank you for watching my video and I will have pictures at the end.